she just went from being the coolest designer I'm lucky enough to have seen to the uber coolest. Friday shows just get bigger and bigger. They're more and more of a performance. I would love to know what makes Mucha Prada tick. That was absolutely extraordinary. Extraordinary is not enough. She did it again. It's like changing the rules one more time and still being beyond Prada. Incredible. Incredible. I was speechless. This was top, top, top. Pop, pop, pop. I loved it. And if it wasn't for Mucha, I wouldn't have a stitch to wear. I was seeing sportiness, I was seeing summer, I was seeing glitz. She put everything together what you need these days. You look at the tennis court, you look at the fingernails of uh, the Williams sisters, you look at the mashup that uh, the pop stars do. The fusion is really good and very now, I think. I love it, I love it. It's such a strong collection, like you dare to do this. To get this bra ornament over a coat, you have all this fur in summer, you have this kind of shoes and this kind of leg warmers. Leg warmers. Love. All these sport reference mixed with like her beautiful jewelry and embroidery. And, like and glitter. I, I even spotted like embroidered uh, eyebrows. I got London, I got LA, I got New York, I got modern, I got fun, I got risky, I got daring. Her mix was genius in terms of like having the street meeting like her own closet somehow. The shapes were incredibly Prada, but then you had like these street moments. There was a lot of street language. It's the art really coming in, more than fashion. Art sets the agenda. It's really at the center of the stage. It really is a boost of energy. That whole show, from the paintings, to the vibe, to the art, to people being able to enjoy it, I just thought it was like a slam dunk. You won't forget this show. This shook the earth.